I don't know how how set it is at this point. I mean, you know, we're we're trying to get um, consistency with our starting lineup, um, and then um, you know, a, a little more of a set rotation off the bench. Um, if we're fully healthy, you know, we have an idea of what we'd like to do. So, um, if we can get good health here the next couple of weeks, then I think we'll um, we'll have a much better sense of um, you know how we're going to close games. Um, uh, you know, Chris is almost always on the floor um, down the stretch of close games. Um, so are Draymond and Steph and Clay, generally speaking. So you're really talking about one spot, you know, um, if, if everything goes how we think it's going to go. And, um, you know, it, it's been wigs for the last couple of years, and it could still be wigs. But if, you know, Moses has it going, for sure, we could play Moses. Um, if we need two bigs, we'll play Loon. So... We definitely are keeping our, our options open. Obviously wasn't in the rotation. Um, how big is that, what he did? It's huge just because that's what he's asked to do right now. And like every, everybody in our locker room you know, is challenged to stay engaged, you know, approach it the right way. It doesn't mean you have to be happy about it. I mean, you have to uh, quote unquote accept it, but you can't let for him, the challenge was not letting, you know, not playing in the first half and, and being out of the rotation for a second change when his opportunity or his preparation for when his opportunity came. And that's the difference, you know, in a, in a win for us tonight. If he didn't do what he did and stay, stay ready, um, show maturity with that, like, we lose this game. So that was, that was, that was huge. That's all you had to say about it. Hey, Jonathan, for, for us, uh, for us mere mortals, what what does it look like up there? That dunk, like, what was it like? What's the air like? Uh, she. Uh, I don't know. I think it always happens. It's just that connection with me and Dreamer. It always happens, like, most of the time. It feels great to be up there, though, so. Coach Kerr said you were the story of the game, obviously. You came in pretty late into the game, but gave him an obvious spark. Just kind of take me through what that was like for you going in, feeling like you – did you feel like you were going in late or did you feel like you needed to go in and give the team a spark? I mean, doing whatever I just did out there, I mean, that's that's our job, young guys. I mean, you see Moses, you see the things he's been doing lately, you see in BP, and obviously the things I just went out there and did for the team. I mean, we're the young guys. I mean, we're supposed to help our team, bring energy in. And I knew somehow it was going to be me, either me, Moses, or anybody uh, that was going out there and lift the team up. And obviously, I ended up being a person. And so, I mean, that's all that matters. Hi, Jonathan. Yeah. Along those lines, how do you just stay ready? Um, you, you may be in the rotation one night and not not as much um, necessarily the next or depending on matchups. And do you just have this frame of mind that says I'm, I'm going to be ready whenever whenever my number is called? I mean, it, it ain't the first time it happened. I mean, so obviously I know what it is whenever I go in a game. I mean, it's not the first time. So if it was the first time, I'll be asking my, myself, like, what do I need to do? So. I actually know what I need to do when I haven't played and when we really needed to get through that type of harm. I mean, that's obviously what the young guys out there supposed to be doing. But, I mean, I'm always ready. So regardless, anytime if my name haven't been called, but like I always say, I'm a professional. I know my job. I know my role. All that matters is just go out there and finish the job. Have you grown into how you learn to, to do that? I mean, definitely. I'm going to keep it real, definitely, because my first year, I really, I was just surprised, but it's just a learning experience. I mean, we all we all go through that phase. Uh, so I'm obviously, I, I obviously grew out there, and I know what it is, so that don't phase me at all. Were you surprised when you learned, I mean, you, you wouldn't be in the rotation? I mean, I wasn't. I don't know. I don't know. I was just, I was just chilling on the bench. I was just being a good teammate and bringing the energy, helping my teammate 
play and just encouraging him. I didn't really know that I wasn't going in, but obviously I ended up going in bad. I didn't really know anything, so I wasn't really surprised. Generally, how do you feel like you've been playing, you know, the first however many games this season? I feel like I've been playing good. I mean, like I said, it's a deep team. You don't know what's going to happen. It's not. All that matters is just be happy for ever playing good out there. So that's obviously what I'm, I was out there doing. I was happy the way everybody was playing. Moses, BP, and just the rest of the guys. You knew when you came in, you are probably going to be guarding Simons. How much does, when you get to guard a guy like that, how much does that kind of get you going and, and just from, turn your, comp your competitive juices up? I mean, uh, definitely going out there without playing for a long period of time. I mean, I'm still trying to figure it out. I'm still cold. I haven't warm yet. I mean, just going through that time. When did I go in the game? Third quarter or something like that? I mean, at that time, I knew I wasn't really playing. But obviously, that one up and down, I'm still young, so you're going to take me just one up and down to get a little warm. And knowing that my life on the line, I got to go guard the best player. Uh, it's, just a, it's just a mental and a focused thing that I really needed to do. I really needed to just look at myself and like, yo, this is the moment. Just go out there and play free and you know what to do. I mean, that's pretty much what it's, what's it been. Do you relish playing against a team like that that's young and athletic and long? I mean, it seems like that's the kind of game. As Steve said, that the Warriors needed you to match that. I mean, to play against a team like that that is so athletic. I, you, I could play against any team. It don't matter. Right. Yeah. But you enjoy that particularly to play against? I enjoy playing against anybody. Uh, along the lines of that question, when you're watching in the first half, how are you sort of seeing what Portland is doing and how you can make your impact? What, what were you noticing about the game and, and maybe putting in the back of your head as you went in what you could do to, to make a change? I mean, it was just definitely like watching how everything was going. Uh, and just my mentality was just going out there and cut the water off. Uh, and I feel like it had to start with somebody. Uh, and I'm not going to say I went out there and just switch everything by myself because everybody was on the floor, everybody was playing. Uh, just going out there, adding a little piece that was missing uh, to give us this win. I feel like just going throughout the game, I was just watching, like, if I get a chance to go in, what I need to do. And obviously, just sitting on the bench and watching the game is more different than being in the game. And that's what kind of helped me to go through that game. What do you take from going into the game? And once you got in the game, you really didn't really get a break. I mean, you only missed like one second the rest of the game once you got in. What do you take away from that, that you stayed in the game the rest of the way? I mean, <clears throat> I'm always ready. Uh, I work every day to stay in shape. Uh, that's not the question. I mean, like I said, chances like that, you don't just let it go. And regardless, even if you're tired or no, you just keep going. So. I think that's what I went out there and did. Anything else? Cool. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate that.